Hello everybody, it's Jordan Computer Scientist here, and 2022 is over. Sorry I couldn't make a video um, in the past like month and a half, close to two months. Um, college and, you know, internship. But I'm not going to keep blaming those because 2023 is the new year and I'm still going to have college and an internship. So I'm going to have to start posting more either way. You know what I'm saying? So that, that's what I'm going to do. But I'm going to update you guys on everything that kind of happened in the past month and a half since my last video and kind of tell you what my plans are moving forward since it's, you know, a new year. Also, happy new year, everyone. But regarding my last five classes um i know you guys may remember that video where i told you guys i was taking five classes and i was scared that well my advisor said that my gpa could possibly drop because i'm taking five classes and i actually ended up getting all b's in one a so that was good that, that made me feel pretty pretty okay so now my gpa is a 3.106 or 8 or something like that and I think this is like the best I've done since maybe like my first year of college when I was an accounting major. Kind of satisfied with that. Next coming up as in like tomorrow or the third. I don't know. My college said that they're opening up on the third, but my class starts tomorrow. But my class could have changed to the third. I don't know. I, I don't know. So we'll see. But right now, I just say starting tomorrow. I'm taking chemistry over the winter for three weeks, so I'm going to get that credit. So it's taking it over an entire, you know, 16-week-long uh, course. And during those 16 weeks <laughs> of the actual spring semester, I'm going to be taking six classes instead of five because I really want to graduate this year in 2023. I wasn't going to take um, six classes. My plan was to actually take five this semester, two summer classes, and then five fall but um, I kind of was playing around with everything and I saw that it only cost 30 extra dollars to um, enroll in one more class. And that class is at 5 p.m. It's once a week and it's on Mondays only, which means that I would still have time to work. So it didn't really conflict with my schedule. So I just, I just kind of added it. I am not really nervous to take six classes. I feel like I should be, but I'm not because I mean, once again, I, I'm used to working like 60 hours, you know, when I was working two jobs, 60 hours total, like every week. And now I'm working like 20 to 20 to 29, 25 to 29 hours every week. So with that massive drop in hours, I have a lot more time to study and way more time to just kind of stay on top of everything. And I think that is one thing that kind of helped me pass all of my classes last semester and then on top of that um i'm planning on taking two summer classes still and then four classes in the fall just to lighten my load on my last semester so i don't stress as much you know i feel like this will be a good idea especially since i took three summer classes last summer and i passed all of them one with a c but still passed <laughs> but I, honestly i just feel like once i get through this spring semester i'm only going to have summer and fall summer kind of flies by fall is fall flies by just like it did last semester and then it's going to be that time where i get a bachelor's degree in computer science and i just it's my only motivation you know every time i'm doing homework and i don't feel like doing it i just think of me never doing homework again because i'm not going back to college for masters i'm sorry to all the people that are you know i'm not i'm just it's not for me i've accepted it i'd rather just you know stay in the house and whenever i get bored make projects in my free time which is what i do and have done so yeah um my plan forward is to use my youtube channel a little more for my own accountability again which is the reason i started it um another goal of mine is to kind of finish all of my udemy courses that's like a really big goal of mine because you know i bought them and they've just kind of been sitting there and i'm pretty sure everyone has this part well not everyone but a lot of people have this problem where like they just buy udemy courses and they're like damn you know i still didn't finish but oh i'm gonna finish that yeah i don't really have a lot of 2023 goals so that might actually be this entire video <laughs> um happy new year everybody 
Comment what your New Year's resolutions are, if you have any. I know some people think that they're stupid. I just kind of, I, I like to have fun with my life. So I just make goals every year. Sometimes I don't stick to them. A lot of times I don't stick to them. Sometimes I do. So just comment your goals in the comment section below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. My name is JordanTheCS.js on Instagram and JordanTheCS on Twitter. Don't forget to join my Discord. The link is in the description. And also like, comment, and subscribe to help me out with the YouTube algorithm. And I'm gonna try my, my hardest to post more in 2023, a lot more. I have like a number that I have to hit in my head. So yeah, thank you for the support and I'll see you in my next video. I'm